Have you gazed at the moon, wondering whether it might eventually drift away from our planet? You're not alone, and this revelation might be unexpected. The moon is gradually moving away from Earth. This phenomenon has intrigued scientists for many years, and the underlying reasons are fascinating. Today, let's delve into this phenomenon and uncover what will happen to Earth when the moon has moved away too far. Before we get to the scientific intricacies, it's important to explore the lunar history. A predominant hypothesis proposes that the moon came into existence approximately 4.5 billion years ago, shortly following the formation of the solar system. The prevailing theory posits that the moon originated from remnants left behind after a collision with a Mars-sized object, leading to the expulsion of debris into space. Over time, these scattered fragments gradually merged, giving rise to the moon. The gravitational influence of the moon on Earth may have played a pivotal role in the emergence of life on our planet. Across the ages, the moon has undergone continuous transformation, shaped by collisions with asteroids and comets, as well as volcanic activity. Its surface bears the evidence of this dynamic history, adorned with craters, mountains, and expansive plains. Since those early times, the moon has orbited Earth, wielding a gravitational force that governs the rhythmic rise and fall of tides. However, scientists have observed a gradual expansion in the moon's orbit over time. This implies that the moon is gradually distancing itself from Earth at an approximate rate of 3.8 centimeters per year. So, why is this happening? The explanation hinges on two primary factors, the rotational dynamics of both the moon and Earth, and the gravitational interplay between the two celestial bodies. The phenomenon of the moon moving away from Earth is termed lunar recession, and it arises from the rotational motions of both the moon and Earth. To understand the mechanics at play, it's essential to understand the fundamental principles of gravity and orbital dynamics. While the moon completes its orbit around Earth, it exerts a gravitational force on our planet. Simultaneously, Earth reciprocates by exerting its own gravitational pull on the moon. The cosmic tussle between the moon and Earth induces a shift in the moon's orbit towards an elliptical shape. As the moon's orbit elongates into a more pronounced ellipse, its distance from Earth undergoes an increase. This is attributed to the diminishing gravitational force between the moon and Earth when the lunar body is positioned farther away. The strength of gravitational force is contingent on the masses of the objects involved and the distance separating them. Greater masses yield a more potent gravitational force, while proximity intensifies the gravitational pull. When the moon's orbital path around Earth deviates from a perfect circle and assumes an elliptical form, consequently, the moon periodically fluctuates between closer and more distant positions in relation to Earth. Proximity amplifies gravitational forces, leading to a slight acceleration of the moon. This acceleration propels the moon slightly ahead of its anticipated location within its orbital trajectory. As the moon advances beyond its anticipated location, it encounters a gravitational attraction from Earth's equatorial bulge. This bulge stems from the Earth's rotation, leading to a slight outward protrusion at its equator. The gravitational influence from this bulge imparts a minor deceleration to the moon, prompting it to drift slightly farther from Earth. This cyclical pattern of the moon intermittently surpassing its projected position and subsequently being decelerated by Earth's gravitational pull repeats iteratively. As a consequence of this recurrent phenomenon, the moon's orbital dimensions progressively expand, signifying a gradual increase in its distance from Earth over time. It's crucial to recognize that the rate of lunar recession is variable, contingent upon factors such as the moon's position within its orbit and the Earth's equatorial bulge orientation. Nevertheless, over the course of millions of years, the cumulative impact becomes substantial, resulting in the moon's migration approximately 384,400 kilometers away from its initial proximity to Earth. In summary, the moon's gradual departure from Earth arises from the intricate interplay of gravitational forces and tidal influences between the two celestial bodies. 
However, it's important to note that this process unfolds over an extended time frame, spanning billions of years, and won't yield immediate consequences. Indeed, the gradual distancing of the Moon from Earth carries several implications. As the Moon extends its orbit, the diminishing gravitational pull it exerts on our planet might trigger alterations in climate and potentially impact the stability of Earth's axis of rotation. So delving into this phenomenon is crucial for understanding and preparing for potential future consequences on our planet. Yet, the prospect of the Moon escaping Earth's gravitational influence is exceptionally improbable in the foreseeable future. Presently, the Moon is gradually distancing itself from Earth at a pace of approximately 3.8 centimeters per year. However, it would require billions of years for the Moon to reach a distance where it could potentially break free from Earth's gravity entirely. Despite the extreme unlikelihood of this event occurring anytime soon, let's explore the hypothetical consequences of such an extraordinary scenario. The absence of the Moon would bring about prominent alterations in tidal patterns. The Moon's gravitational pull is instrumental in creating tides a phenomenon driven by the Earth's rotation and the Moon's gravitational influence on the oceans. In the Moon's absence, tides would diminish in size and occur less frequently. This shift could have profound repercussions for marine ecosystems, where numerous species rely on tides for their survival. The changes in tidal dynamics, resulting from the Moon's disappearance, would extend beyond ecological impacts, influencing coastal regions and human activities. Coastal landscapes, shaped and eroded by the ebb and flow of tides, would undergo transformation. Additionally, the field of tidal energy, currently explored as a potential renewable resource, would face setbacks as the reduced energy from smaller and less frequent tides diminishes the harnessable energy available. The absence of the Moon's gravitational influence would not only affect tides, but also induce alterations in ocean currents, potentially impacting global weather patterns. Ocean currents play a pivotal role in regulating heat distribution across the planet and are integral to the climate system. Any disturbance to these currents could result in significant shifts in temperature and precipitation patterns, giving rise to droughts, floods, and other extreme weather events. Moreover, the cessation of tides would have consequences for navigation, particularly affecting ships and boats. Currently, tides assist in regulating water movement in ports and harbors, contributing to safe navigation. Without the moon's influence, these areas would become more susceptible to flooding and heightened risks. The fishing industry, which relies on the predictable rhythm of tides, would also face disruptions, impacting its operations and sustainability. An additional consequence of the moon's disappearance would be alterations in climate dynamics. The moon's gravitational force serves a pivotal role in stabilizing the Earth's axial tilt, a factor influencing climate patterns. The Earth's axial tilt is instrumental in the seasonal variations experienced, regulating the distribution of sunlight across the planet. In the absence of the moon's stabilizing influence, the Earth's axial tilt might become more erratic, potentially giving rise to drastic climate fluctuations and even posing a threat to biodiversity through possible mass extinctions. Furthermore, the disappearance of the moon would trigger changes in the Earth's rotation rate. The gravitational influence exerted by the moon currently contributes to a deceleration of the Earth's rotation. In the moon's absence, the Earth's rotation rate could accelerate, resulting in shorter days and longer nights. Such changes could profoundly affect agriculture, as plant growth is intricately linked to the duration of sunlight exposure. Additionally, the Earth would face an elevated risk of asteroid impacts if the Moon were to disappear. The Moon currently serves as a protective barrier by attracting and deflecting asteroids away from Earth. In the absence of the Moon's gravitational influence, Earth would become more susceptible to asteroid impacts, potentially resulting in catastrophic consequences. The Moon's gradual retreat from Earth is just one facet of scientific research. Researchers are also delving into how the Moon's changing distance influences our interactions with other celestial bodies in the solar system. Notably, 
The moon plays a pivotal role in stabilizing Earth's orbit around the sun. As it distances itself, this stabilizing effect may be impacted, potentially leading to alterations in our planet's climate and weather patterns. Moreover, the moon's movement raises considerations about its impact on our capacity for space exploration. The moon has long been regarded as a potential outpost for further space endeavors, but its increasing distance poses challenges in reaching it. The ongoing exploration and study of these phenomena highlight the wide-ranging implications of the moon's departure from Earth. As our exploration and understanding of the moon continue, there is a certainty that we will unravel additional mysteries and unveil more secrets about the vastness of our universe. Let us know your thoughts about lunar recession in the comments section below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.